Hi guys, today I'm going to talk to you about my mom. <laughs> my mom, um, ever since she was um, young and came to this country, um, she started getting asthma attacks. Um, and it really depended on where she was and what, you know, different things would trigger these asthma attacks. As she's gotten old, and we'll discuss some of those other things that she's experiencing, but today we're specifically talking about asthma. As she's gotten old, um, she's had a lot of problems with mucus, which I always talk to you guys about mucus because I think that mucus is really... Um, something that our body is not supposed to have inside of us. Um, it really is an indication of infection. And um, she she has like immense amounts of mu mucus constantly coming out of her, constantly spitting up mucus, constantly, constantly. It's disgusting. Anyway, um, the doctors, they don't know how to treat it. They've given her all kinds of things. She puts this patch thing on sometimes she says that makes her feel kind of crazy um, and none of it when she's experiencing all of this mucus dries it up or does anything to resolve the issue so of course you know since I've been taking the diatonaceous earth and she's been hearing these stories these wonderful stories that I've been telling you and been telling everyone else she decided she was going to take it now, it always amazes me that um, people think that they've had a condition all of their lives, it's deteriorated into what it's deteriorated into, and then have like zero patience <laughs> to see if in fact it can be resolved and or maybe your lungs get stronger or I don't know just give something some time my mother took diatonaceous earth and on day one she was like oh my god oh my god <laughs> um I don't want to jinx this but you know the mucus has slowed down quite a bit and then by day two she was like, well, it's not as good as it was yesterday. And by day three, she'd quit. Okay. Now, I want to just speak to those people who think that health should be just like a microwave. Like you're just going to stick it in the microwave and in two seconds flat, <laughs> you're not going to have the symptoms. The symptoms are not the problem the problem causes the symptoms and what I was trying to explain to her I'm like ma it's going to need to build your body up to correct whatever the actual problem is that's causing the mucus and then you will see an improvement with the mucus not to mention the fact that you're probably filled from mucus with mucus from head to toe you know what I'm saying I mean the body has to release and get rid of all of this stuff so long story short um, she stopped taking it and she stopped taking it for like a year and it wasn't until the story that I told you last week about Roosevelt when she heard that she started taking it again and now she's taking it and she's had all kinds of chemical reactions that she's noticed going on with her body. But more than anything, while she is still experiencing a lot of mucus, she is a lot clearer and she's not had the dramatic, um, she's had negative, negative kind of um repercussions that happen with her as she's getting up in age with the asthma lasting longer and turning into pneumonia and all of that stuff she's not had that since um you know and she's ha she's had slight very slight asthma um attacks that normally escalate and they did not ex escalate so I'm glad to report that my mother finally, hopefully, knock on wood. Let, where's some wood? I don't got no wood around here. I'm going to knock on it later. That she continues so that her body can heal. And again, I just want to stress that it's not the symptoms. You have to get at the root so that you can heal yourself. 
Have a good week.